Hey everyone and welcome to this video. Today I'm at a junkyard and the junkyard I'm at is Jackson's Auto and Wreckers located in Waynefleet. Waynefleet, Ontario and anything you see in this video, this one is for sale for parts. Um, there's more over here, there's more over there and there's a Mustang 2 right here which would be for sale complete if you guys are interested in it but that's not the focus of this video i do have a video specifically on that one showing you all around it and but the focus on this one is this one here but first and foremost if you guys like these videos please do hit that subscribe button as well as like this video so this one here i would it is a chevrolet chevelle uh i would guess mid 70s era uh, Somewhere around the 70s era and um, this one here has obviously been sitting here a long time you can see the frame is uh, all but there anymore underneath and uh, well it's she's finding her home back in the ground where she came from and uh, the fender is just gone uh, but if you look it's became a greenhouse too but if you look the windshield is still usable and the hood is definitely still usable. The doors, uh, they might be. They might be usable still. I would say there's some chrome from it too in here. Maybe that's from this one. And wow, this one's just, this one's been sinking in the ground for a long time, but by no means does it mean there's no parts. Here's the, here's a bumper maybe for this car but yeah like I said guys if you're interested in any parts for these old classics they are for sale I will have the contact information in the description below for you if you're interested and back here we have a completely rotten floor and once again look at that the frame is just not even there anymore There's the front door from it. This one is definitely not any good, but you do have these tip out windows in both of them that are still good. But you guys, if this, if this wasn't so rotten at the bottom, this would be a perfect patina car. Pretty sweet. It was a custom, which I believe was the base model back in the day for GM. Uh, I could be wrong on that one, but as far as I know, custom was base model. Rear glass is intact. And that's just regular glass, I believe. It's not even tempered, but if someone's looking for a period correct original glass, here's a piece. And is there an engine? There is an engine under it. It looks like a straight six. Looks like a straight six under here. And it probably would have been an automatic transmission. But yeah, there's a whole bunch of parts saveable on this. If you guys are interested, like I said, down below will be the will be the contact information for this yard but yeah that's a around a 70 you guys would know better than me of course so I'll leave that up to you guys but I love that green color anyways thanks for watching if you enjoyed this video please hit that like button as well as subscribe for more have a great day everyone